Welcome back everyone for the next part of Devil Survivor Overclock. And I guess it's about time that we head to the cemetery. Who in their right mind would go to the cemetery around the evening time, huh? I mean, it's not midnight, but it's around the evening time. Why would you go there? And there's a battle! Oh god! What, what are we doing? Oh no! Oh no! Here we are. So, who would be at a place like this? Skeletons, ghosts, creepy stalker, everything that's creepy, spiders. You don't want to know it, sir. Don't tell me it's a ghost. I feel like there's something out there. All those graves. Hang on a second. Aoyama Cemetery. That rings a bell. It does? Oh, the email, right? Huh? The explosion. <laughs> Oh god! Why? Why did that happen? What happened? Was that an explosion? It sounded like it came from the other side of this forest. An explosion in Aoyama's cemetery around 1900. It's just like what the email said. Oh. Look! Something's coming! <laughs> that human. I mean that woman. I've never seen... Oh my god, I never knew humans could have such power. <gasps> Wendigo, wait! A Wendigo? Oh, we are the last of us. No, wait. Oh god, I forgot the name. <laughs> the, the butterfly game. <laughs> Fools. <laughs> You're nothing like that woman. Do you really think a tiny thing can stop me? Oh, he punched him. Wow! Uh, Lady Amani. That was just a punch! Why are you bleeding? I'm so sorry. What happened to you? He didn't even put out some... Oh, his timer. He didn't even put out some glass or try to hit you with the horns. It was just a punch. Oh, God. The humans are pests. Kill one and another takes its place. I will kill you all. I found you, Wendigo. I won't let you get away this time. Oh, it's the girl from the opening. <laughs> so that French thinks she can stop I me. Mean, she can catch up to me. Hey, you need to run away. It's too dangerous. What are you talking about? Did you see? She looks very strong. We should be the one running right now. Forget her, Atsuro. That demon killed someone. We have to run now. See, for once I'm on user's side right now. <laughs> Oh. Oh. The doggos. And the pixie. That's not good. That's not good at all. What the? How many demons are there? Too many. I saw four, I think. Yeah, I saw four. Defeat all demons. Rei, Atsuru, and Mizuki. I mean, Yusu. Why the hell Mizuki? Yusu died. And I need to dispatch both of them. Nice. Okay, let's see the position. I'm going to place myself right around here so that I can tackle this guy. That Zoro is going to be right beside me. Ooh, wait. I need to switch the screen to show you guys. They even show us our movement. Me and Atsuru have both four in our movement departure, so it means we can move four tiles. Why Yuzu only has three, but her speed seems to be a bit higher than us. So in that case, maybe it would be a wiser choice to put Yuzu closer to the target, while I go to this location, huh? That sounds promising, right? Uh, can I also make a save, or...? Yeah, yeah, I can create a data. Good. Well then, let's start. Yeah, I know I don't have a skill. I gave it to Yuzu, but it's fine. I have seven right. strength. I'm gonna do this. I'm gonna live through this. Sure. You there. It's dangerous here. You must evacuate immediately. I want to, but the demons are on the other side of my party as well. I'm kind of surrounded here. It's not like I can run. But how? We're surrounded! See? Those comps... Why do they have them? 
Hey, say something! I guess I have no choice. I'll cooperate with you. But Wendigo is far too powerful a foe for you right now. Leave him to me. Huh? I will follow your orders. Direct me as you please. The priestess joined your party. Oh, I can control her. The cops have activated the harmonizer for battle mode. Function will be limited. What the? There's a message on the cop's screen. This okay. must be the tutorial that email mentioned. They showed up when we were fighting too. I guess some functions won't be usable. Hey, are there any functions you can't use on your comp anymore? Well... Oh, the floating numbers vanished. Those numbers you mentioned back at the Electric Museum? What the hell are they? I have no idea yet. Oh, wait. It looks like there's more to the tutorial. Uh, each statement race has special skills called race skills. There are two kinds, automatic activating skills, common activating skills. Use the race skills to gain a, the upper hand in battle. You can view the race skill effects with the help menu. So, Great. I've got to use these demon skills, eh? Well, whatever it takes to survive. Oh, we've got no choice but to fight? I'm glad we have demons on our side, I guess. Why are you sounding so sad and depressed? I mean, at least you're not alone, right? So, we can see that they have a fire weakness and usage just happens to have a fire skill. A team's considered of three units, you, the summoner, and two contracted demons. Be cautious of the following. The leader is in the middle. If the leader is defeated, the whole team is destroyed. So long as the minions live, the leader takes less damage. If you defeat the leader first, the XP and Maka of the remaining monsters are- Oh! Oh, that means I'm supposed to kill the team first before killing the leader, it seems like. It is to your advantage to kill the minions flanking the leader. Okay then. Let's use Agi and... Agi! Sure, I take the cat. Oh my god. Okay, the cat. The cat is broken. I can see that. It's fine. I... I'm just going to burn those guys down with no trouble at all. Even though the cat is kind of frail. I mean, one hit and he almost lost, lost half the HP. Oh, he learned another skill. Yes, we beat one. Good. Wait a second. Defeating demons summoned by others doesn't make them join us? Kind of unfair to have to fight them then. Didn't you read the message? Only the first demons are going to be contracted. That thing told us about it, the, the admin. Oh, Yuzu. Oh. Wait, you can... Ah. Uh, wait. How do I check my party again? Uh, no. No. Animal leg. Can move again after attacking. That's... That's very good to know. Well then, I'm just going to move myself around here. Then we're going to use heal on Capuso. And with that, I'm going to end my... Ch oh, never mind. I guess uh, now I can move him. What does that do? Guarantee us one critical hit. Yeah, sure, why not? Critical hit. And attack. Those with active turns displays are at an advantage and will receive more turns. This is how extra attack, I mean extra turns work. Higher speed grants higher chance of getting extra turns, which means agility is pretty good. The attacking side gets them more often than the defending. Your actions during battle may also give you an extra turn or cancels your opponents. Exploiting an FOE's, I mean, oh my god. A false weakness lands a critical. Use these tactics to increase your chances of getting or cancelling an FOE. Why am I still trying to call them FOEs? A false extra turns. A miss or an attack that is resistant, absorbed, or reflected may aid your foe, so please be careful. Pay close attention to your foe's status on the cards, top screen, to avoid this. And that's why you always need to watch out for that. 
Make those extra turn disappear and take it for yourself. Strike their weakness, elemental weakness and land a critical attack. Good that we use the, the, the thing to get a crit, right? There we go. Oh my god, why am I so strong? So strong! Imagine if that was a crit! That would have been crazy! Cobot, you are kinda lacking actually. But at least you are able to buff me. So that's fine. Uh, Alright, only the cat makes me move again. Uh, on your ally's turn, you can open the system menu by pressing start. Here you can check the turn order or use other convenient functions. The start menu? Alright, oh, okay. Uh, I think I'm going to move closer to this doggo and wait. She's level 31! Are you serious? Okay! Uh, wait. Let me check out this guy. He's level 19. <laughs> 246 HP. Oh no. Oh no no. Yeah, I'm not gonna fight that guy with my level 4 guys. I guess I'm just going to wipe the floor with him. Wendigo, go back from whence you came. Am I seeing things or is she holding a comp? Well, I guess she also uses a comb if she's able to fight a demon, right? Ooh, I have my Ragi! Oh my god! <laughs> oh, human! I've learned your smell. This is far from over. Bye. I won't let you escape. Please excuse me, I must go after that demon. Sure. Bye, uh, purple girl. Uh, Tsuru, are you going to take care of that guy? I mean, that would be really nice if you do. First of all, let's kill this guy. Yeah, Pixie, I don't, I don't really think you're going to help out a lot. <laughs> and uh, Tsuru, your magic attack is also very lackluster, so uh, yeah. It's better than nothing, and it has a weakness, so... You're out of MP already? Seriously? Okay, uh, it's all, it seems like you're not supposed to use magic at all. Okay, uh... Wait... It's going to attack him again. Seal... Attack... You crit me? Are you serious? Pixie! Why? It was totally unnecessary. You have been bound. Movement it was, is reduced to one. It will last for one turn. Level speed will cancel it. Cool. Hmm. Uh, let's kill that guy first with... Sure, why not? Yes, son. There we go. I should probably should have used Argy instead, but oh well. Just attack and finish it off. Unless, of course, she just decides to heal herself like that. I mean, it's just going to waste a turn. And I could have saved that. <laughs> You're actually going to heal yourself again? Okay, I'm just going to grab you off then, if I get the chance. Attack! With Agi and Agi. There's no way you're going to... Yeah, of course not. She's not going to survive that. Mitsuru's... I mean, Yuzu's way too strong. And now... I guess Atsuru is going to finish up the cobalt over there. Maybe he should also get healed. Yeah, that's probably a better choice. Okay, I guess it's over now. Attack! Finish it all! Oh! 
Pixie, please don't die. 8 HP, Pixie. Yeah, okay. Okay, finally, she is useful now that she has a magic skill. That's good. It's very good. So, uh, what are we going to do now that, uh, that we killed off the demons and the Vendigo thing is running away and all? And give me more speed, please. Uh, we made it through. Somehow, I'm still shaking. There's nothing we can do about it. What we just went through, a, a person was killed. Uh, hey, the animal that attacked that person in the apartment. It was a demon, wasn't it? Probably. At least it's very likely. Yeah, yeah that's what I thought. Demons, huh? Looks like we're prepared for the worst. In any case, I never thought the Shomankai would be fighting against demons. They were using comps too, and the demons didn't really scare them. That explosion must have been caused when they were fighting earlier. They knew about the demons way before we got our comps. That means the demons have been around for a long time, right? Probably. What are the Shomankai? Uh, I don't know. But if they also have comms and they were fighting against that Wendigo thing, maybe they will try to be heroes, but eh, let's just stay with, I don't know, for now. Yeah, we really don't know anything here. Anyway, there's no doubt that that Shomankai girl had amazing powers. Right, she wanted that guy. And she was already level 30. That big demon Wendigo seemed to be afraid of her too. Could she be the person mentioned in that email from Naoya? Hmm, she might be the one. I wonder too. She seemed really strong, and I got this feeling from her. The emails, the demons, and now the Shomunkai? Damn it, it's too much to think about. All we can do now is pray that nothing more happens today. What the? The streetlights went out! What's what? going on? Uh, oh no! The email! It came true again! The email? Oh yeah! That's, that's the it. third time! What's wrong, Atsuro? He's right. It's a blackout. Remember what was in that first email? It said there'd be a blackout. Is this for real? We don't know if it's citywide, but so far it's all coming true. No way. I can't use my phone. Huh? Why not? How can you not have reception in a place like this? Is this because of the blackout? But the phone centers have their own backup power, right? This doesn't make sense. I don't know. I just can't use my phone. Uh, I hope it's only temporary. I'm really tired. It's pitch black. I never thought Tokyo would be so dark at night. Hey, what are we going to do now? We should probably leave this area. I don't really want to be near a cemetery, you know? Wait, someone's coming. So you're all safe. What? Aren't you that girl from a little while ago? Yeah. I am Amane Kazuryu, maiden of the Shomonkai. It's nice to meet you. R right. I'm Atsuro Kihara, and she's Yuzu Tanikawa. Oh, um, hi. And this is... Ray. Kihara, <laughs> Tanikawa, and... I shall remember and your names. mine. I shall remember your name. Oh, God. The Wendigo seems to have released his minions into this cemetery. I have set a simple barrier around this place tonight. It's best if you stayed here. You can place barriers around areas? M minions You mean demons? You said we should stay, but this is a cemetery. It's better than dying. Wait here until dawn, then head for the station. I must be going now. Hey, w wait! Damn, what's going on? She said to stay here until the sun came up. Well, we can only follow her advice right now. I mean, uh, it's dark. We don't know the play area, right? And uh, the demons are running around, so uh, I, I would really like to stay in that barrier. We don't have a choice. If she's right, then it's too dangerous to go anywhere now. B but this is a graveyard. I, no, I don't want to stay in a graveyard either, but it's the only safest place right now. It's the creepiest, safest place I ever saw, but it's safe. Are we going to be okay? We'll be fine. Y yeah, 
I don't think I can go far anyway. My legs are like jelly. We don't have a choice. Well, let's take turns keeping a lookout. Yeah, that's that's a good choice. Uh, I never wanted it to be morning so hard in my life. Oh, we got mails. Uh, let's read the extra term first. A brief explanation, the higher your agility, the easier it is to get. I think that's just a, yeah, it's just a repeat of the battle. So, we got a mail from Naria. I'm sure you've noticed the Leplant's mail by now. Uh, Kazuya, everything in this world has cause and effects. If some intelligence could record and analyze every event simultaneously, the future would no longer be a mystery to us. Ultimately, nothing created by man can ever be truly perfect, but you can use these magic to guide your action from now on. So you created an intelligence that is able to do that? Good to know. And at low. Hey, it's a zero. I was messing with my com and saw that the email app is still working. Even in the blackout, if you know someone's com address, you can send emails directly to them. Plus, it looks like two coms will automatically learn each other's address when they get close to each other. It takes a while though, I'm going to teach you so how to use this function. Too much stuff happened today. I'm so tired. I just wanted to be morning. You and me both, and it's almost midnight. Uh, oh, I could send no reply. I'm tired too, and teach Yuzu for me. You know what? Actually, I'm also tired. I mean, demons. I lost my cousin. There was an explosion, a murder, and a blackout, and we have to sleep in the cemetery. Oh yeah, I'm tired. And with that, there's nothing else to write. Oh, I can save. Nice. Oh, already an hour. Ah, I should have waited one minute. It would have been such a nice time. Oh well. Tokyo Lockdown. Oh, morning. Did you get some sleep? Did you really expect me to sleep? In a cemetery? No! I stayed the whole night awake! That girl was right. Some demon-looking things passed by, but they didn't notice us. Yeah, I saw them too. But but now that the sun's out, we can get out of here, right? Uh, don't get careless, okay? Uh, why do you have to go and say stuff like that, you idiot? Because it's dangerous! You need to be careful at all times. <laughs> yeah, I hope that's the last time I ever have to sleep in a cemetery. But the lights never came back on. Hard to tell in daylight, but there's still a blackout. Yeah, I still don't have any cell reception. So none of that was a dream. Huh, hmm? that was the comp's email beep. Wonder who it's from. G guess we should read it. Yeah. Oh, now yeah. Kasuya, you're still alive, aren't you? I'll explain the dead clock to you. The what? The dead clock? The dead clock displays the number of days a person has left to live. The details are, the dead clock is only available to the party leader. A single digit, 0 to 9 is why the 9 again <laughs> is displayed. If a person has 10 or more days left before death, nothing is displayed. Finally, the dead clock is simply a value calculated by the LeBlanc system. A person's action can cause the value to change, so be careful. A dead clock. Oh, and uh, the observation of today. Good morning, here's today's news. Power outage will continue in all ports of Tokyo within Yama Yamanote Loop or Yop through the day. It is unknown when power will be restored. Poisonous gas is suspected to have escaped from underground's pockets. All train servers is cancelled across all lines. All exits from within the Yamato loop will be closed. Why is that a thing? At around 30, in Shioda-ku and Bukyo-ku, 
a localized blizzard will occur, three victims will be murdered by a snowman. A snowman. Have a nice day! What? A snowman? Okay. A, a death clock? What's up with that? So we can see how long people have left to live? Oh, shoot! We have zero! Hey! Didn't no. you say before that you could see a number over our heads? Oh no! <laughs> yeah, I did. Well, what was it? Hey, how many days do I have? You don't want to know. It's zero, isn't it? Yeah. Yesterday you said the number was one, which means our number right now, it's zero, isn't it? <laughs> that's, uh, that's right. <laughs> oh man. I'm gonna die today? Yeah, but, uh, but don't be sad. All of us are zero. <laughs> That's it. I've had enough. Uh, this stupid conversation is over. Come on, let's go. This is all some big hoax. Let's hurry back home. <laughs> you really think we can just uh, just go? Didn't you hear the trains aren't working? <gasps> what do you mean? You so you really don't read. Calm down, Yuhu. I checked the other email. Don't you remember what it said? She's she's not reading at all. All stations are locked down. Now, if that's true, we won't be able to use the trains. But but how can we know for sure unless we go? The email might be wrong about that. The email was right three times already. Why would it suddenly be wrong? Oh god. Okay, let's go to the station. Yeah, I'm with you. No sense in griping about it here. Let's check the nearest station. God, please let Shibuya Station be open. <laughs> I don't think this is going to work. But oh well. After leaving the cemetery and emerging in Omote Sando, Yuzu suddenly stopped. Hey, you guys, look! Huh? The road is littered with ruined cars. Other vehicles seem to have been abandoned. What the hell? What happened here? Seems like the blackout affected the whole area. What a mess. Did all this happen just because we had a blackout for one night? Could be. I mean, it was pitch black, right? The blackout can be scary. Sorry, guys. I don't think this is because of the blackout. Alright, the demons. The demons probably also had a part about that. Huh? What do you mean? Headlights aren't hooked up to the power grid. Accidents this bad wouldn't have happened. Then, it really is because demons are in Tokyo? Probably. There's no proof, but that'd be my guess. Let's hurry. We're almost to Shibuya. I mean, we did saw that Wendigo thing, right? That thing was dangerous. Level 19. Level 19! Oh, God. The streets to Yima... God, this name is... Yima... Suzuka? I choked with crowds. No one can get near Shibuya Station. So much for that, huh? You can see self-defense forces, vehicles, and a barricade past the crowd. Why? Poison gas has leaked. This area is dangerous. Please stay away from Shibuya Station. All lines, including private rails, are affected. Remain calm until the problem is solved. Remain pl oh, Remain calm Well, there's a blackout. Car crashes everywhere. Demons running wild, but please, please, the poison gas is the least problem right now. <laughs> Police blockades are in effect throughout the Yamanote line, including overpasses. All the rail lines? Then how are we supposed to get outside the Yamanote circle? Hey, what's going on here? I demand a full explanation for this. The cause is currently under investigation. Until then, please obey our instructions. To ensure everyone's safety, we ask for your understanding and cooperation. We're also looking into the explosion that occurred in Aoyama Cemetery last night. If you have any information, please inform a disaster relief worker immediately. Huh. The angry mob slowly quieted down upon hearing the SDF officer's repeated message. Eventually, the gathered crowd begin to disappear. I mean, disperse as if they are giving up. Why are they giving up? They could just rush the barricades and get out of here. I mean, there are demons around. Damn, not only aren't the trains working, we can't even get near the station. Was that stuff about the gas leak true? You think this is because of the demons too? Probably. I mean, there's possibly a 
a poisonous demon around, right? I don't know. Seemed to me like the self-defense force guys were just lying. Why would they lie? Huh? You think they put up all these barricades and blocked in the entire area overnight? Now that you say it... No. It looks to me like all this was prepared way in advance. Now that you say it, it does sound weird. W wait you mean... Yeah, there's something else going on here that we don't know about. Damn! Everything that email said is coming true. At this rate, we're gonna... Oh no, don't say it! Don't say it! We need to raise the number, you okay? change how long we have on the death clock? <gasps> Good idea! Now use email so the number changes based on what we do. Right. So let's do something about all this. That Laplace mail stuff about not escaping the Yamanote area and us going to die today? Let's prove it wrong. <laughs> I'm surprised to hear that from you. The death clock and the Laplace mails do run on the same predictive algorithm, which means the death clock uses what the Laplace mail says to calculate a number. Its probability ratio is pretty high. The underlying process must be real complicated. Hey, hey, slow down, WizKid. You're getting a little ahead of us non-eggheads. Oh, sorry. It's an important point, though. So with an algorithm this complex, one mistake could cause a very large error. Which means, if we make sure the things the Laplace mail predicts don't come true, its predictions become useless, affecting the death clock's readout. So that means we can... Oh, we can raise our number that way, Does right? Does that mean we don't have to die today? That's a good idea. Seems so that way. So we have a chance. It's not certain that the results will be thrown off, mind you. But it's probably safe to assume that we can change the outcome. Uh, is this really possible? Well, it's our only chance, right? <laughs> What's the matter, Yoo-Hoo? This was your idea. Huh? But I didn't know all that stuff you were talking about. Ah, there's the Yoo-Hoo we know. Don't sweat it, okay? All right. Let's do whatever we can to find a way out of this lockdown. As long as we prevent what's predicted in those emails, we can beat the death clock. Yeah, come on, let's go. Even if the area inside the Yamanote line is locked down, there must be a secret exit. Right, but we'll have to be careful of the police and the self-defense force. Huh? Why? Because they tried to lock us up. Didn't he just already point that out? Uh, oh, right, we also have to come on us, right? He's right. If they get suspicious and interrogate us, they'll take away our comps. And then we would have a real problem. There's a lot of strange stuff going it's on. It's like a real problem. I'm sure the police are questioning people. Remember how the SDF guy at the station said they were looking into the explosion? Oh, yeah. Okay, then. We'll be extra careful. So then, when it comes to tech demons, the word battle will appear on the location list to warn you. Most battle cannot be avoided, but you can flee from some during battle. Ah, there's a free battle right over there. In Shibuya. But, do I really need to fight that? I mean, I mean, uh, do I really need to fight that? I mean, there's a, there's a new guy. He looks kind of angry. Let's talk to him. As you approach the station, you suddenly hear people yelling. When the hell are you gonna let us out? Never. We'll lift the lockdown once we can confirm the area is safe. Please wait until then. Yeah, yeah, you said that already. I'm asking when that's gonna happen. No matter how often you ask, the answer is the same. Now go back to the safe zone. What? You wanna say that again? Quit yapping like a dog and shut your cake hole. Huh? Who the hell said... Kaido? I'm sorry, man. Kaido? Hmm. <laughs> okay. Kaido? Like Kaido of the Shibuya Demons? What? You know him, Atsuro? Ugh, more demons. That's the absolute last thing I want to hear about now. Come on, you who. They're not quite the same thing. A demon is a guardian spirit. The Shibuya demons are one of the more charismatic punk gangs. Kaido, they're really famous in Shibuya. Okay. You think he has seen Naoya? I mean, he I knows get it. very much Even about if that. he doesn't know, maybe one of his flunkies will. And Kaido is known for treating his people well. Yeah, let's go talk to him. Hey, Kaido. Huh? Who are you guys? 
probably your best friend for in the future. <laughs> Tell me your name. Cool. I'm Kaido. You guys need something? Informations. Uh, do you know Naoya? Huh? Naoya? Who's he? Oh, my cousin and all. He's his cousin. We don't know where he is. You know, he's kind of been missing and the demons and all. Well, things <laughs> are pretty bad around here. So I'll help you look. Got a photo or anything? Oh, I, this I is actually the guy, have. huh? Send me the pic over IR. Cool, got it. All right, once the cells come back on, I'll spread it around my crew. Isn't that all you wanted? Uh, is there a secret exit somewhere? You ask Kaido if there's any secret exit from the Yamato Circle area. If I did, I'd have used it already. We're having trouble getting through the central ward. Ah, uh, I had a feeling you'd say that. Everyone's in the same boat here. If that's all, I'm gonna get going. Okay, goodbye, Kaido. Hope we see each other again. Huh? <laughs> no need to be so formal, man. All right, be seeing ya. Bye. And how'd it go? Were you able to see what the death clock said about Kaido? I think it was six. Yeah, six. Six days? It, it was that short? That means he has less than a week, right? You say, are you kidding me? We have zero. Six is perfect. Well, don't be ridiculous. It was <laughs> just a coincidence. Six days is better than our time. My God. Y yeah, but. Sorry, didn't mean to bring you down like that. Come on, let's get going. We'll find a way out and change our fate. Y yeah, let's go. And where are we supposed? Ooh, new mails. Now we are. What are you doing, Yakus uh, Kasuya? I've written a new application for the car, so I'm sending it to you. Once you read this email, the option of the Devil Archon should, should be available in the comms menu. You should be getting an email from the auction site too. You know Maka, the prince of the nether, uh, the nether world, right? You get it when you defeat demons. You need Maka to buy it in the auction. Money makes the nether world go round too. Cool. Keep surviving. I look forward to seeing you again. Now, yeah, you could have just said me where you are and then we could meet right away. Welcome to the Devil Auction. We are a member based auction site that helps you with the bothersome task of forming contracts with demons. Great! Demons will make themselves available as merchandise to bid upon, upon the Devil Auction's members. The winner will be able to make a contract with the demon and will have a powerful new ally. Spend your wakes of sin at the devil auctions. Okay. A devil auction? What is this? What's going on? It seems like we're able to buy our demons. <laughs> the demons are selling themselves. Great. It looks that way. One thing's for sure now. Demons have been on this world for a long time. And some people have known about them. Seems like it. How can you be so sure? Think about it. For an auction to exist, you need someone to run it, and you need someone to buy from it. If there are other bidders than just us, then the auction has been around since before then. Uh-huh. Okay, I get it. Still, it's kind of a shock. We were living here, but we knew nothing at all. Hmm. But this is an opportunity to learn more about this world, right? Opportunity? Yeah, I and... get it. And we are able to get more demons. Well, I don't get it. I don't get anything. Oh, sorry. Well, there's a chance we might die today. And considering what's happening, it would probably be because of a demon. Ugh. But if we can use this website to get powerful demons as allies, we can fight back. That is true. In other words, our chances of surviving will go up. So you're saying that we have to get demons so we can fight even more demons? Yeah, and protect us with a meat shield of demons. I've had enough of this. Why do we have to fight? To live, Yuzu. To live. We have to live, uh, okay? That's true, but let's see if we can just run away from all this, okay? We can try that, but in case we get trapped again like last time in the cemetery, we need to be prepared to fight our way through. Yeah. If we can escape, that would be the best option. But if there's ever something we can't run from, we'll have to make up our minds. See, Atsuru understands me. Okay, I agree. Yeah, we'll have to use this auction and do everything we can to help us fight. 
Which means... X button. Let's see the auction. Hello Ray, welcome to the Devil Auction. Welcome to the Devil Auction, here's some information on your first time users. This site uses a ranking system. Use this ability to purchase demon as rank depending. As your rating improved, you may enter higher auctions. Winning raises your rating, failing to pay lower. Be uh, begin by selecting a demon. Okay. So we have a fairy with three. I think it's the same thing I already have. But it seems like there's something wrong. What is that red thing? Is that a boost? No, I think the blue is a boost. The red is a... Maybe it's a worse thing? Ooh, this one has five stars. And those have two and three Let's try to get the five... How much money do I even have? 323. But I can give it a try, right? Okay, let's start bidding. How do I bid? I can begin it right now, or I can just buy it with 225. Yeah, let's not try to buy it at that high price. Let's uh, just begin the bidding and see how it goes. Auction lasts 5 seconds. You may drop out at any time. Avoid buying more than you have to preserve your trading. Okay. I'm just going to wait for the last second. Two. Uh, let's make it 180. All other buyers have dropped out of the auction. In this case, you are the winner by default. Cool! And I didn't have to pay 225. Just 180. Pay your bid. Oh, thanks you kindly. <laughs> now I can pay my ma back. Okay. Your rating went up by one. Just one? Ooh, this is going to take a while before I level up, I guess. Uh, how about I try to get a capuso for everyone because animal leg is actually kind of useful yeah and another pixie would also be quite good but first let's get the capuso this one isn't as good as the last one well, let's try to get it either way three two one there we go uh, Let's make it 99. Final bid. If auctions end with two or more bidders, you enter final bids. Both bidders bid once more and the highest bidder wins. Okay then, we're just going to say... 147. <laughs> oh god! One by far uh, four points. Good. Here, there you go. Uh, so much for buying the pixie, but I guess uh, now that that I have two extra cats, I'm just going to get the good cat, and he's going to get the other cat, and that should do the trick, right? Yeah, it's just a little bit worse than the other cat. But now everyone is able to move twice. So that should be good, hopefully. Anyways, I think I'm going to make a cut here. And in the next part, we're trying to escape this lockdown and hopefully avoid our dead. Because I d I'm way too young to die right now. And I don't want to die right now. Okay? Okay. See you in the next part. Bye!